tomorrow's October 22nd assignment there. So this is group area the deal. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So the first thing before I even start this discussion is we ask you to create good templates and just find your own budget sheet. So to do this, I just hit my start button, type Excel. Once I open up Excel, I just need a blank sheet. So I just come in here and go to blank worksheet. Now I go to file new. And I can go into templates right here. And there's personal budgets. So I can go to personal or I can just go up here and type budget. Either way, what all I'm doing is looking for a personal budget. So there's a monthly company budget, there's balance, there's all kinds of wedding budgets, you know, general budgets. So anyway, I'm just going to go this first one, personal budget. I go to create. It tells you about template, tells you how to use the expense incurred, various categories and that. So that's the kind of start deal. If I go here to personal budget, I can go in here and change these values. So my income, and let's say it's 3900 for this month. Extra income, I had zero. And I just kind of go in and fill this in. So actual monthly income is, you know, going to be that 3900 from up here. So, and there was no extra income. So um, that sets this difference over here. What I can see is projected. Well, you know, sporting events, I don't go to sporting events. I can go over here. Let me zoom out a little bit. But you can just go and change the values in here to entertainment. Got no entertainment, waste removal, you know, what applies to you. If you don't have to pay cable, you can put zero in here, you know. And so that'll take the difference. The actual cost is zero. So I'm not budgeting anything on that, you know, and take it out of there for my monthly expenses. So you can just kind of play with this a little bit. If you have no charity cost, if you need to delete something out, you can delete the whole thing, delete the whole call table rows or whatever, and take that out. Um, legal. Don't have any yet, so I can delete that out. Oops, right click and delete that out. And just make my own, my, own, my own sheet. Make sure you get the whole table. So remember how when you're selecting tables in here, these are tables inside. You have to have the whole thing selected before you'll be able to delete it. And then I can delete the rows out of that. And then projected cost that. This is going to be screwed because the reference is pulling from other budget tables up here. That's why this all screwed up because I had one that you know was in here that's now gone. So I can change this and mess with it, do whatever I want. I could have found a lot simpler one. But anyway, when I'm all said and done, I delete this all out and get it cleaned up the way I want it. Now I can go in here and save this as Samson's budget. And personal monthly budget one's fine. Now I can close that out, go back into my discussion here, hit reply. You know, and so this is talk about, you know, what's your favorite Excel skill? I like the charts for visualizing stuff. You misspell some, you know, visualize. I definitely screwed that up time. Visualizing wasn't even close. But, um, you know, what was an aha moment? My ah, my aha moment. Not getting if function to work properly. So after my last assignment, I got really mad about that properly. Still working on it. I am going to figure that out, what I was doing wrong. You know, what cool thing did you learn or discover that you get very sick if you catch COVID? <laughs> kind of a smart ass, but... That really was a big learning discovery. And in Excel, I learned so much. Like goal seek. So once you get that done, now we just got to attach the uh, um, insert. Go to insert. And we're going to insert a document, upload a document. And then I go click on my Excel document, that personal monthly budget, you know, and then submit that. And it'll put a link to that budget. And that's it, you know, hit the reply. So, so anyway, hopefully that'll help you with that assignment. If you have any problems, let me know.